Hi, this is Anne from Strep Bridal Salon. We specialize in sizes 12 and up. Today we're going to answer the question so many brides ask, do I need to wear a slip or petticoat under my wedding dress? And the answer is, it depends. It depends on the silhouette, the quality of the fabric, and the weight of the fabric. For example, if you're wearing an informal or beachy chiffon gown like this one, you likely won't need a petticoat. If you're wearing an A-line or ball gown style wedding dress, you'll likely want to add a slipper petticoat. Our model is wearing a tool ball gown. You can see that the bottom just hangs loosely by her feet. You can't see a lot of the beaded detail. And when she walks down the aisle, she'll likely get the dreaded bridal wedgie. Here's our model in the same tool wedding dress, but now she has a ball gown petticoat on underneath. You can see that it gives her a lot more fullness, shape and structure. You can see the detailing a lot better here at the bottom as well. Heavy fabrics like satin almost always require a petticoat. We also recommend adding slips or petticoats to lesser quality gowns because they often don't have as much structure built into the skirt already. Finally, we tell our girls that almost all wedding dresses photograph better with a slip. But we do say to our curvy girls that Slips do add extra layers, so it might make you a little bit warmer. Well, those are the reasons you need to wear a slip under your wedding dress. For more information, please click on my name, and thanks for watching.